Up next on Race Weekend, we feature the highlights of the third round of the 2022 Race Motorsports Club National Slalom Series held at Robinson's Antipolo. Welcome to another edition of Race Weekend. This time, it's for the third leg of the National Slalom Series here in Robinson's Antipolo. Let's go check it out. When I was starting, I started from uh, slalom. So for me, this is one of a uh, good uh, foundation for the new newbies, new generation. That's a good uh, choice of uh, motorsport to start with. Slalom this year, so nagahabol kami ng points since I had a lot of absence. My biggest competitor is myself, but I don't put any pressure sa sarili ko. Kung ano lang yung kaya ko, then that's it. Okay, I am here with a multiple slalom uh, champion, uh, Milo Rivera. Hi Milo, uh, what are your thoughts early on in the season here at the National Slalom Series? Well, it's starting to be very um, tricky as early as the first legs of the race. Uh, you see tight battles going on uh, between Pawi, between Stefano, my brother, and all the other competitors and drivers here in the slalom series. So, being a spectator or from a spectator's point of view, it's actually very interesting to watch. Not going to lie, it, it tempts me to want to hop back into the car and, and try it all over again. But I guess for now, my priority is Stefano. I see. So, you know, uh, seeing the young younger generation emerge, uh, you know, of course, like your brother who is a, who is a staple at the, at the top level. Uh, what can you see with the kids these days that you saw in yourself while you were racing here at the National Slalom Series? Passion. Uh, I think that's the first word to, that comes in my mind when it comes to their development from such a young age. It's really the passion. They love what they're doing. They love the competition. Um, and of course, they love the drive to win. Um, and I see that with each uh, hurdle that they have to pass or to go to, um, it makes them even better. And I think it not just reminds me of myself, but it uh, gives us a good idea of how competition is supposed to be. Um, which, which makes me very happy and really warms me. Um, I don't even have to, I can look beyond my brother. Um, I can see all the other guys, um, regardless of age for that matter, um, putting in the effort, the time, just to um, achieve a certain objective. And um, whether it's, it may not be a win, but for others, it's uh, learning. For others, it's just the recreation, the passion for it. And regardless of, I guess, um, the results at the end of each day, um, I think what matters most is that they leave the races with a smile on their faces. Um, I'm looking forward to win the novice title, but no expectations muna para there's no disappointment in the end. So ngayon season, ang strategy namin, syempre ngayon nga uh, leg 2, medyo nawan kami ng uh, handbrake. So sisikapin namin na makuha pa rin yung mga trophies.
Well, I heard no, the the sport is coming out, all the motorsport, because of this, you know, the pandemic and everything. So I think we we will get back on our own feet, you know, in the next few months, maybe next year, everything is okay na. I think, yes, I do. I believe, and I believe, I believe, madaming eager lumabas to do to do motorsport. And I think I suggest, you know, you should try slalom. It's uh, it's fun, and it's not so expensive. You know, it's uh, it's something that you guys will always uh, will use for something. I, I I went I started here, and I when I went to drifting, drifting had a big part. Uh, slalom had a big part in drifting for me. So um, thank you to Bing and to Lito and this this motorsport. Huh. <laughs>